it's a convenient box that we put things into when when we're learning new things, right? Um, it's a it's about literacy, digital literacy, and so forth. Uh, we recognize the need for AI agility because of the fast moving nature of the technology. The literacy is a little more static in nature. So when we think about AI agility, there are six components. The first one, which, which um, we recently reordered them just based on priority. And the first one has to do with building healthy and sustainable partnerships with AI. We think yeah. about uh, partnering with AI the way we partner with people and colleagues when we're working together. Uh, the second piece is around AI literacy and prompt design. The third has to do with creating intrinsic value at work, for instance. And those first three elements are really the sorts of things that people can do and bring them into their organization or into their work or just do them on their own. The next three are around uh, achieving responsible AI uh, so there's all sorts of elements around ethical and safe and transparent and explainable and so forth. And we have an entire guide or a playbook aimed at responsible AI. Uh, the fifth piece has to do with navigating the skills-based economy, which of course you know so much about and, and have really helped me understand more about the impact and the change with your book, Career 3.0, and the, the changing nature of work, worker, and workplace. And then the last piece has to do with cultivating human skills. And this is kind of comes full circle because we consider AI agility to be a human skill.